my. We got little baby Jeff Jeff here, looking all happy. Hi friends, it's Misty. And you know what? I was looking on my phone this morning and I saw that there is an auction today. So that's what I'm doing. Now here in my area, they do not have estate sales. They have estate auctions. So the nice, the nice thing about it is that they typically they're in a different location than the home itself. So they bring them like today we are at the Lawrence County Fairgrounds. But the bad thing about it is that they are a day. I mean, it's an entire day that I will be here today. So I don't know what's in here. I've looked at the previews. It looks pretty good. But we're going to go in and we're going to see what we can find today. And hopefully we can get some good stuff today. So let's go into the estate sale auction. Okay, just walking in and this is the community building. Oh, there's a whole thing of um, glue sticks down there. Christmas things. I'm going to go put some of my stuff down to save my chair. There's some games. These will be when they get to the lots of things. They'll break off to where you can get some of these things. But there's a lot of smalls over there that we're going to check out. A lot of furniture and a bed. So we're going to see. Oh, I've got some figurines. And oh my. we got little baby Jeff Jeff here looking all happy. Oh, lots of Tupperware. All right, I'm going to set my stuff down. A lot of advertisement pieces here. I just sold this one. The junk with the plane on it. And the red devil lighter fluid. If it doesn't, oh, let's see. If it doesn't have the barcode on the back, that's, that's an older one. So the ones without the barcodes would be better. You can loosen a nut. Cut rust saves time. Engine oil. It's an Edison. This is a Edison record player deal. Atlas polishing cloth. I do like that. I like that. Blue ribbon. Neat's foot compound. Smoke red camel. That's a reproduction. Tobacco tins. It's an erector set. I have a couple of those I need to get rid of. Oh, this is neat. Fix your Chevrolet. I some bot oh, I just sold this. Suncrest. I have a lot of bottles that I need to sell too. Some um, buffet lamps. This is a reproduction. We've got little, oh my gosh, these are cute, these little Sinclair dinosaur. So these would, they would have these at the gas station for the kids to get. Oh my gosh, look at the dino soap, Sinclair. That's pretty cool. There's a little Sinclair dino banks. Wright Motor Company, Fort Branch, Indiana. Gas nozzles. I have several of these too. I need to get listed on eBay. Milk glass. The windmill pattern. Salt and pepper shakers. Trains. Trains, trains. Some of the boudoir lamps. Times tables for the Greyhound bus. Oh, we got some swan vases here. We have a blue one. I like this green one. These are both Ellie Smith. I do like those. We've got a box full of little things in here. We've got some plaid thermoses. The 1960s this is the cooler. And then the picnic sets are over here with the coolers. Plaid thermoses cooler in the picnic basket. Glass rolling pin. Doctor's bag. Doctor's 
soap. It's a little doctor's kit here too. You probably know what is in here? Thermo bins. I don't know. Some kind of something. Tractors. Ooh. I like these Bolero pieces. Fire King. Oh, too bad that doesn't have the lid. Fire King. Nineteen fifty six Elvis, the Jordanaires. The Gettysburg plate, Mount Rushmore. Life magazines. These are Department fifty six, probably. Yeah. The Village Milk. I not want those to go for. Those do sell pretty well on eBay. Oh my, this is what my husband will be looking at when he gets here. Mark will be looking at the license plates. <laughs> yep. Ooh. Oh, well, hello, Mr. Leopard. TV lamb. And hello, little girls. You made me a cake and everything. You're Ukago. Your little friend is Ukago as well. She's making the batter and you're making the cake. And this is department 56. He goes over there, but we're not going to move them because they get mad when you do that. Oh, here's a McCoy vase from the 70s. And fancy pants. So we've got lots of McCoy here. It's a magnolia dish. It's restaurant wear. That's probably uranium. I do have my keys with me. A handy dandy. Yep. That glows. It do. Spring blossom. Cream. Ooh. What do we got? Juice cups, salt pepper shakers. That is Avon. More Department 56. We've got some more dishwares in here. That looks like a, I see a couple planters in there too. Cars do nothing for me, but they'll probably go, people will probably like these. I like this because I collect these. I have a whole display of clocks, so I do like that. These things do pretty well on eBay as well, these tire ashtrays, especially the Firestone ones. Here's a leather strap. You, they use this to sharpen blades. A lot of times people would come into the shop looking for those. To um, sharpen the straight blades. Ooh, he is fun. I like the panda. It's a little sink. Some brown drip glaze. Coca Cola clock. Yeah! <laughs> Got a little Tom Thumb. Cash register. This is St. Clair. St. Clair paperweight. I don't know if it's Joe. I can't tell. Boyd's Bears. Oh my gosh, we have this. My, my husband, Mark, went to the Olympics in Atlanta in 96. That's one of the things that he brought home as a souvenir. Are these McCoy? They are not Mark McCoy. They still could be, though. They are. This one is McCoy. I can tell by the swirlies on the bottom. Not all of them are marked, but... Yeah, those are McCoy. Enamel mugs. One more. 
one of these. I like the box of these ice skates. Got Indiana. Oh, I like this. California pottery. And got some beads. This is the only state one there. 14 karat gold filigree. Oh, look, here is the blue silver crest. This is Fenton. Blue silver crest. This is Fenton. It's signed. It's not marked, but it is Fenton. I'm going to test it and see if it glows, but. No. No. It does not glow. I saw one year at South. Your pocket movie viewer. Big stack of maps. I do like the maps. Four times. And over here we've got some more milk bottles and bottles. Postcards. French Licks. This is a local hotel. Here this highly collectible. People like to collect French Lick and West Baden. In Syracuse, China that has a pretty design on it. Oh, boat anchors. That's what I like to call these. This one's kind of cool though. It's an aluminum one. More Christmas villages. Primitive tools. Look at those metal shoes. My word. Brass. There's a brass fire extinguisher. Those are pretty collectible. Oh, these are the ones that I like. Yeah, I like these postcards. That's something that I will be trying to go for. It's a nice canister there with the lid. Canister sets. The biggest one, the sugar one's missing the lid. Shenango, China with the Department of the Navy. This is probably from the Navy base that is here. This area. Fiesta. Lots of Fiesta. Oh, there's Mark. He's right there. In the blue shirt. So, there isn't a ton of things. Mark, that will be Mark's words. When we see him, you wait. He'll see. We don't really see much of anything. That's what he'll say. Trust me, I know him well. Over here we have James Dean. And this is um, Jane something, Western Jane. She looks complete too. This is pretty good. This sells for pretty well on eBay. Ooh, we have a Zorro costume in the box. Is this Pluto? Yes. Pluto water. Now, this, someone has attached this label. It's not the original label. But this Pluto water is from French Lick. And it was the pleasure chest over there. That's good. Our cash register. Oh, look, you can... What would you make out of that? Grapes? Wine? So what do you think of the auction? I haven't looked very far, but it looks like a lot of man stuff. Uh-huh got a display case. We've got some records. What records do we have down here? <gasps> Conway Twitty. This one looked groovy. What was on this groovy record? Oh, Tijuana Christmas? But Mr. Retros would like that one. Uh, Jerry Lee Lewis. Andy Williams. What's this one? 500 Miles, the Murphy Town Singers. Oh, there's some ashtrays. Pretty cool. Oh, yeah, the unicycle. Oh, gosh, that would be that would be a trip to see for sure. Look at the ashtray pop on here, though. I thought that they were birds, but I'm kind of thinking that they're girls. Are you girls or are you birds? I don't know. I can't tell. Pretty neat though. Those go for pretty good money too. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. You have. 
You got no eyeballs, baby. You're cute as a button. Okay, let's fix you. Your, your baba don't hurt anybody. Well, here we have Larry. Mo, oh my, Mo, and Curly. They're golf head or golf club covers. That's what kind of fun. Ooh, I like this. Oh, this is cool. Oh, that's neat. The little duck is missing his beak, though. He'd pick up your cigarettes. He'd pick up your cigarettes for you. He's cool. He's missing his beak, though, unfortunately, but I love that. This is Hopalong Cassidy. Yep, Hopalong Cassidy milk glass mugs. Oh, good old Hoppy. Oh, and David Crockett. All right, we're going to check down this next aisle. This isn't, there isn't a whole lot here. I mean, there's a lot here, but it's usually chock full of more things. I was really hoping I'd see... Some art glass. I mean, there are those two swung vases that I would like to try to get. Hopefully, they'll be sooner <laughs> and not later into the auction, but we don't know. So, they'll get to these lots over here and they'll just break off and it'll just be, they'll start to say choice for a certain amount of money. So, you really do kind of have to, when you go to these auctions, you really do have to look through these boxes because sometimes there's things hidden. There's things hidden in the bottoms of these totes. The minnow bucket without the lid. Oh. This is a cardinal. This has cadmium in it, so it will glow. I'll get my light out. This one is in great condition. It is Leo Ward, 1989. Yeah, Leo Ward, 1989. This one is has cadmium had me a minute. I don't know if you can see, but down here on the yellow, that will glow. Is your beak good? You always have to check the beaks. Well, who are you, Schwan? You are, what does he say? I cannot read. It says it. You're Murano. Ice tea. So, we might try to get him too if we can. What is it? This is a cool, this is a cigarette case. That is nice. It is missing some of the inlay here, you can see. But, wow, keep your cigarettes in there. If you smoke, you keep your cigarettes in there. That's a pretty one, too. Okay, right now he is auctioning all coins, pocket watches, things that I'm not really interested in, but I thought you might want to see some of the action. Five here, we get seven and a half for choice. Five here, we get yep. seven and a half. Now ten down, ten. Five, we get ten here, we get ten. Seven and a half, ten, seven and a half here, we get ten, ten. Twelve and a half here, we get twelve and a half, ten, twelve and a half, ten, twelve and a half, fifteen. Fifteen dollar five, we get fifteen dollar here, we get fifty five, we get fifteen dollar here, we get fifteen. So we get twelve and a half. Eighty six. six. Broken off into two rings, so there's a ring there. And then a ring over there. And all this makes me have a little bit of an anxiety attack because I, you know, I can't be in two places at once. Mark is standing over there. I've got a few things so far. I got the James Dean doll and I got some metal wall plaques of like these little boys playing baseball. So the whole back row over there and the other ring is a lot of things that I'm not necessarily interested in. So I'm gonna go back to my station over in the other ring hopefully I can get some over here. Just checking in a little bit, I'm going to show you some things that I got. So I got the James Dean. I used to have this, but it was $5 and nobody was bidding on this. So I had to get James Dean for $5. And then I got these. There's a set of, I think four of them. They are Sexton from 1970. So we've got the little boy batter and catcher. They're upside down, I know. And then we've got the little basketball players. 
which I think are really cute. I think I paid $7 for that entire set. And I got more to look at this one underneath the table, but I got several of these um, Department 56 houses for $5 each. I love the split level house and the Paramount. And then I got all of these postcards. Oh, there's some good ones in here. I think I paid $30 for all three albums. And I mean, they are full. They are full, 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 full. And I did get some of the Pluto water bottles, the embossed ones. They are Pluto water. They got the devil there on the bottom. I got two of those for three dollars each. So that's what I got so far. I just bought all of those yellow cups. Mark's down there wrapping them up for me. Seven and a half. My seven and a half. Bob would get seven and a half for choice. Now ten. Now ten. Twelve and a half. Twelve and a half. Fifteen dollars here. Would get fifty. Bob would get fifty. Twelve and a half here. Would get fifty. Bob would get fifty. So the twelve and a half. One oh seven. Taking a little lunch break. A coney dog for me. Barbecue sandwich for Mark. They're doing some Crocs right now. We've got some stuff. Good news too is I actually got some new bedding for my bed. It's brand new. It's never been opened, and it's made by UGG. But it's not ugly. It's very nice. So, and I was still was still halfway. Had more than halfway. There's just a few more things that we were kind of waiting on. Then we'll probably leave. Although it is nice to stay the whole time at an auction because people leave things behind and then you can get them for free. So. Anyway, we're having a good time. All right, so I'm sitting in this chair that I bought. I bought this chair. I paid $10 for it. Let me show it to you. And I sat in it and I loved it, so it is now my chair. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I'm gonna take it home if I'm going to keep it at the shop, but I liked it. It's a big booty chair. I got a big booty. It fits well. All right, so I was able to get a couple pieces of furniture for Emma, for her apartment, uh, which is good, and there's still a few more things that I'm waiting on, so we're still here. We've been here since nine o'clock. What time is it? It's 12.42. That's the thing with auctions. They are an all day event. So you'll actually, you'll be here all day. That's the unfortunate part of an auction. But they're fun, they're fun. And it helps that the auctioneer is a lot of fun too. You know, kind of jokes around with people and it's just kind of entertaining too. So stay tuned, we're still going. It's thinning out a little bit. It's very hot today, but we're getting to the very, very end of the sale today. But there's a few more things that I still want, so we're still hanging in there. All right, I'm getting ready to check out. The auction is almost over. So I'll show you, briefly show you real quick some of the things that I got. I will be doing a haul. Just a quick peek at what I got. So stay tuned for the haul. Dun 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 d